This video we're gonna talk about detailed in form of the fuel pump. Firstly, the pump casing. We select several fuel pumps to have a 100 hour salt spray test in the laboratory. VVKV1 has no change. It's specially processed, so the casing won't rust or oxidize within five years on the harsh conditions. While these other fuel pump casings have severe oxidation problem after one hour test, it means they usually start to oxidize or rust within three months. Then we're gonna introduce the main parts from the fuel pump. All parts are processed by CNC machine and grading machine to make the part size as accurate as possible. In this way, the heater can avoid burning carbon accumulation. This fuel pump core is made of stainless steel. It's super hard and wear resistant to endure the high stress work. Processed by the precise machines, the pump core and the cooper sleeve can combine seamlessly, so the pump have less stock problem. This is from another brand. As you can see, it has rough appearance. Since diesel sometimes contains impurities and then cannot be completely filtered, these small particles may easily get stuck in the gap between the pump core and the cooper sleeve. This will cause pump stock problems or affect its service life. For each joint area, we use Typhlon as sealing material. The iron core is made of pure iron. There are two models, iron 1214 and iron 1215. We use iron 1215 to extend the pump's life. It has high toughness and it's more difficult to process. Another important part is this spring. It plays a role for reciprocating movement. So we use stainless steel with better durability instead of iron. We have noticed that some fuel pumps outlet is directly pressed into this plastic area. After half or one year use, due to the thermal expansion and contraction, this fuel outlet will easily expand and break the plastic frame. More than 40% pumps will have leaking issue. Our engineer team have improved the pump's structure. We use Cooper sleeves and the Teflon to seal the fuel outlet. This solves the pump leakage and our design has obtained a Chinese patent. There is also a steel ball here. It acts as a check valve. 5 kW parking heater beats 380 times per minute, while 2 kW is about 230 times. Under such high intensity work, the steel ball must be tough enough with a super accurate size. Therefore, we use 440F stainless iron material and its size reaches G16. When the pump works at full speed, it will produce high temperature. So, we use the oxygen-free Cooper rod for this call. It can endure 180 degrees Celsius. Thanks for watching this video. That's all for the fuel pump.